What is this channel actually about? Good day everyone, so, I guess, hi, welcome. So I decided, let's do a video on what is this channel actually about. First off, the channel name, Necrofa. My name is Nate. And what do I do? Well, what do I love? I love photography. The name was really made for Nat, for Necrofa, Nate, Nate photography kind of thing, you know? Looking back, I'm actually happy with the name. I think it kind of flows together really well. Uh, I, I I like the name, yeah, like, I'm not really good with names, but I'm, oh, I'm actually happy with that name, and I'm happy that's the channel name. But yeah, photography. So, photographer, what am I do? What, I like mainly landscape photography, like sunrises or sunsets, beachscapes, like seascapes or cityscapes, those kind of things, but, yeah, like, what is that going to do with YouTube? Because this is videos. And, you know, there's a lot of photography channels out there, but, like, what was my goal at the time? It was mainly just, okay, so I wanted to do, like, photography tutorials and also show off photographs that I've done in those tutorials. So at the time, I decided to, in 2016, just expand on YouTube. I've done a few videos before that, but it was mainly 2016 where I decided, you know what, let's see where this goes. I had, what, 10 subscribers, I think, at the time. It was low, so I'm just guessing. But it was mainly, um, yeah, just doing photography tutorials or mainly photography video uh, vlogs, I guess. But it wasn't really vlogs. It was mainly just um, my phone camera actually recording on just showing where I'm photographing at this location. No voiceovers, no face or anything, just like, here where I'm photographing today and that's about it. So I did a few videos on that. But I also did a couple of videos on, uh, I guess, studio backlighting and natural light. So I did one in here actually, uh, with a background and you know mainly portrait, just like headshots with natural light because the windows, I got a lot of win big windows in here. So that was the mainly idea at the time. I wanted, I like, I liked landscapes. It's mainly about landscapes, of course, but I also wanted to explore portraits as well. And yeah, I did a couple of other editing videos, but you know what, I decided, you know what, that's not really my thing, because the hundreds of videos have already been done of those already. I don't really need to do that. And yeah, those videos are not really popular as well on the channel. There's a couple of videos in there I'm happy with, and actually one of those I feel like is, not, what you say, like not a lot of people have done a video on that thing I did, and it's actually, I'm gonna put that right there as well, as that video, so you can go check it out. It has, I think, a thousand views now, yeah. Yeah, I did a few other videos, but it was mainly 2016. Vivid Sydney. I decided to go to Vivid Sydney Lighting Festival, and I realized I left my light off. Um, I don't know how it's gonna look, but it'll probably look much better now anyway, so... Anyway, so I decided to do Vivid Sydney video. I uh, went down on the first night, so I just put a few clips together, just like recording a couple of clips around Vivid Sydney. It's a lighting festival in Sydney. You know, if you haven't seen those videos, you should, probably should look at them. They're the most popular ones on the channel. So grateful that they are, because <laughs> there's three, four of them, I think, that are now one of the most popular, so really happy with that. But yeah, that it really started off, like, it's only, the first video only has 20,000 views, and at the time it was like 5,000, so it wasn't, it's not a big trend, but it was like a small step, a small gradual step, gained a few subscribers there, and I thought, yeah, let's, let's try a few more of those, but... Yeah, that's not really photography, that's more like just videoing, that's like, it's kind of the same thing. Because I wasn't happy with doing how-to videos, I wanted to do something a little unique, and I'm sure people have done it before, but I haven't really seen as much. I decided to create editing sessions, and those videos are mainly about uh, just putting my photos in Adobe Lightroom and just showing off, you know, the photos I did for, let's say, Vivid Sydney, so all the photos I did for Vivid Sydney as well. Here they all are, I'll display them, and I'm gonna go through how I'm gonna edit those videos and talk about the photos as well, as well at the time. That's something I'm really happy about, they're not popular, but that's something I actually enjoy doing, just talking about the photos and just go through the photos as well, just to see how they, you know, just to see how they go, and I, I enjoy doing those. I did a few other videos, I wanted to do photography videos, I've done like a few camera videos, just showing off my cameras, and I've done like a tripod one, I'm looking at the videos, I'm not going to watch them, I'm just looking at, you know, I've only done 140 something videos on this channel, so 
it's not too hard to just scroll back and have a look at them. And yeah, I like doing a couple of small fun videos as well, so, you know, just to mix it up, like, keep it related to the channel as well, like, photography uh, ways as well, so I, I enjoy those videos. So that's kind of the channel around 2017. I kind of had a clear idea of what is my channel going to be about. It's going to be mainly photography, but not exactly. It's going to also be about uh, film, but vlog, like, it's not film-like filming a movie or something, it's going to be, and I wouldn't even call it vlog, it's more of a, I guess, a documentation of, let's say Bivitsini, um, I'm documenting, like, that lighting festival, putting clips together, putting, like, music as well with it, music is important, like, I enjoy syncing the music to the clips as well, because it, the flow is really good. And yeah, I've done a few of those videos, like, so I went to Melbourne, and I did, a, like, a Melbourne video on that, so it's the kind of same thing, clips together, and put music, kind of make it flow, so I enjoy actually doing those videos, I think those videos are, I don't really know what to say, like, they're not really, f like, film, and they're not really vlogs, they're just, like, a documentation of, you know, the whole, like, like, it's Melbourne, so the whole city where I went and explored. But it's not a vlog like, hey guys, I'm here, I'm doing this, yada yada yada. And that's where I mainly decided to go, I'm going to explore more of that. So I've done videos on, you know, Chinese New Year. I've done videos on the attractions to Sydney. So I've done three videos on Sydney Aquarium. Some of you guys will know why. <laughs> uh, yeah, Easter show. Uh, and, yeah, there was mainly, like, editing sessions in there, like... Usually now they're editing sessions, also if I get new equipment or something I'll do a, like a review or discussion on those. Uh, also a couple, and again a few more other fun videos, so like I did a short silent film. Some of those things I like doing, like I wanted to do like silent films because I don't... They seem pretty simple, like you can just create a, a minute video on just a little simple thing but make it with the, you know, the, that piano music with those captions. And, you know, it can be a little fun, and I enjoy doing that. I did a mockery on YouTube vlogs. You can check that out if you want to. I recommend not, but I I want to keep that for a fun one. That's a fun one. And, yeah, just to do the documentation on Darling Harbour as well. Uh, Chinese New Year. So this is going into this year. Oh, I should mention Vivid Sydney last year. And the Vivid Sydney video before. 73Ks for Vivid Sydney 2017. Vivid Sydney 2018, as of right now, 71,000 views as well. That is obviously the, going to be the popular one. So that's obviously the trend to my channel now. Like those kind of videos, because the other videos are of those clips and those putting those clips together are more the popular ones. So that is like mainly the theme of now of my channel. But I'm going to do like more photography ones. Going to go away soon uh, to Queensland and I'm going to do a few videos there, might do a vlog, I'll see how it goes, I'm going to try, if it's good I'll post it, if it's not then you wouldn't know about it, but I will try, so if it's not on here, well I'm sorry, but it wasn't good, <laughs> but uh, yeah, and also a few uh, time lapse videos, editing sessions, and I also do a few other editing videos on before and after, so I did a couple of videos there on, so my original photograph and how I've photoshopped, you know, an, a different effect with the same photograph, just a before and after, how I did it from start to finish as well. So, you know, right now the channel, 290 subscribers, I'm actually, I'm really appreciated it's actually gone this high, it's gonna probably get to 300 if Vivid Sydney, if I do Vivid Sydney this year again, if that goes really popular again, then yeah, I'm gonna continue doing those. But yeah, that's, you know, that's kind of what my channel's about, and yeah, the name behind it. And yeah, just the, I guess the story, the backstory of how it's all come together to today, which is April 16th, 2019. Nothing has really changed in that time, because if you look back, I feel like I look the same and sound the same. In all the videos. But, yeah, I, uh... Yeah, like, thank you for, if you've been watching my videos and you're watching this one, thank you for subscribing. But yeah, like, I, I just want to say thank you anyway, so appreciate it. So yeah. Oh, and... 
Until next time, I will get back to you.